Hey there football fans, welcome back to Soccer News Center. Today, we've got some interesting news coming out of Manchester United. Football director John Murto has confirmed that the club is investigating the patterns behind their lengthy injury list. Currently, Manchester United has six first-team players out with long-term injuries, including Luke Shaw, Aaron Wambisaka, Lisandro Martinez, Tyrell Malaysia, Kabi Mainu, and Ahmad. And that's not all, several other players have also missed games due to injury this season, including Sergio Reguilin, Rafael Verani, and Mason Mount. Murto mentioned that two-thirds of the squad, that's 16 first-team players, have been injured or unavailable for periods since the start of the season. This means that manager Eric Ten Hag hasn't been able to pick his strongest 11 even once this season. But there's some good news too, as injured players are starting to return, including new signings Rasmus Hodgland and Mason Mount, who are still betting into the team. But why are there so many injuries at Manchester United? Well, it seems like there are a few factors at play. One is the unpredictable nature of impact injuries, like the ones suffered by Kabi Mainu and Ahmad. These injuries are hard to prevent. Another factor could be the sheer volume of games played over the past year including last year's World Cup. Interestingly, Arsenal's head of medical services, Gary O'Driscoll, joined Manchester United as the club's new head of sports medicine in September. Hopefully, his expertise will help in preventing future injuries. This issue has raised concern among the team, with Eric Ten Hag acknowledging that injuries are a concern. He mentioned that injuries are a common occurrence in top-level football because players are constantly pushing themselves to the limit. It's clear that Manchester United is taking this issue seriously and is actively trying to find solutions. They want to understand the patterns behind the injuries and improve prevention in the future. Well, that's all for today's update. Stay tuned for more football news here at Soccer News Center. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more updates. Until next time, keep enjoying the beautiful game.